<laughs> so guys, my name is Ed Guardian, and today's gameplay you're gonna see here today is some Modern Warfare 3 gameplay with the uh, P90, I believe, and like I think I was using Silencer. I'm not sure though. Probably not. Actually, I don't think so. But uh, anyways, besides that, uh, today's scary story is number three. I hope you guys are excited for this. And uh, today's story I'm going to be telling is the original Slenderman story. <clears throat> now, I'm sorry if, uh, if my voice sounds a little weird. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm just getting a cold, you know, when that it's that time of the year where everyone's getting cold. So it really sucks. But I hope I, uh, I will sound pretty clear. And uh, I could tell this the correct way or whatever. So Slenderman doesn't really have like an origin or whatever, like a story behind him or anything. But I did collect some information or well, this is obviously fiction or I don't know if you guys believe in Slenderman or not. It's just kind of a opinion thing. But for me, it's kind of like a fiction, a myth, but it's really cool to study, I think. So uh, Slenderman, he likes children that sounds very like pedophile kind of but uh he likes children and if you guys noticed slenderman has been mostly in pictures with uh children well on pictures on google if you look up real slenderman pictures uh he's always like behind the children in the playground or whatever or just excuse me hidden in the crowd He's never, like, with adults in pictures anyways. Uh, freaking host migration. Uh, I hope you guys won't mind that. But, uh, yeah, he's always with children. He always seems to be in the background of children pictures or whatever. Yeah, so I found out that Slenderman has a certain amount of abilities and things he can do. So, uh, you, you guys know that uh, Slenderman game? How whenever he gets close to you, you well... Actually, Slenderman gets close to you while you have a camera. Well, originally, uh, Slenderman can only confront people without cameras. So that game would be incorrect due to its urban legend or its urban roots. He also has the ability to change forms uh, and its height. So it could go from extremely, extremely tall to uh, extremely, extremely short. You know, it could shape shift, I guess. I don't know. I don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know that part, but I've never seen it shape shift or anything or form into a rock. Slender rock, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, uh, he also has invis invis invisibility, sorry. That means he can uh, turn invisible for a certain amount of time and kind of shape shift. <coughs> Not shape shift, excuse me. He can kind of move around. Uh, teleportation 2, I think, was one of his abilities. So, uh, let's go through some Slenderman facts here. He presents himself to children as a friendly person. He's, like, whenever he wants to stalk a per uh, little kid or whatever, he uh, presents himself as a really nice guy. So, you know, he can get through the, to through the children that he's a nice guy and they will not be afraid of him or tell their parents or anything. He's like... Then after, <clears throat> after uh, Slenderman gets down, gets like through the like seven or the kind of children years of the child, he'll leave them alone, tell the children that he has to go or whatever, and then he comes back later. Now, remember, Slenderman, like he picks people for reasons that no one really could understand. He, uh... He chooses to stalk people that no one, you know, knows for real. Why? So, he only really stalks adults. And it starts with the child, as I told you guys. He uh, starts with the children, and then he goes, he leaves the children for a while, and then he goes back to the adults. So when he starts stalking the adult, he'll start stalking it. Him, sorry. Him or her, whatever adult it is. And the adult will not remember or at least I think that's what it said or it, it might have some memory <coughs> they might have some memory but uh I don't I don't think I don't think they do but they will the Slenderman will stalk the adult until it goes mentally insane being that it, it, it literally like the person seriously couldn't go outside without being afraid like you know 
he couldn't the person couldn't like stand outside its outside or do anything really without being afraid of being stalked he has like I told you guys he has a great obsession with children so most of the time you're gonna see uh, Slenderman stories with children in them actually I've seen I've, I've heard a couple of them there's just one where uh, he actually kidnaps children and uh, the only way like okay so there's just one story I, I'll tell you guys this kind of legend or whatever so Slenderman uh, took this little girl while or I think it was a little boy or whatever well a, a dad and a little boy were playing catch okay with a uh, baseball and uh, the dad accidentally threw the ball too far into the woods and the little kid had to go and get it so the little kid went and got the ball well while he was in the woods obviously Slenderman got him and the only way that his dad could have gotten uh, his son back was that he traded the boy with another ch child so uh slenderman's weird and likes children again as i told you guys earlier so uh what do you guys think of that uh slenderman thing Did you know just leave a like down below or a comment or whatever you guys want to do you know scary stories are always awesome and i know this wasn't really a scary story i told you guys kind of a legend at the end there but uh Besides that, I thought I told you some pretty cool Slenderman facts or whatever. Uh, anyways, you know, if you guys like this video, leave a like down below. And uh, comment your crazy stories or whatever. Oh, we love to hear them. Anyways, we're getting closer and closer to Halloween. I hope you guys are enjoying your Halloween season. I know I am because I love Halloween. Anyways, like this video and uh, look at this 360 because I earned well, not really worked hard on it, but uh, I did get it, and I uh, thought it was pretty cool, so I thought I'd share it with you guys. I thought it would be a pretty good gameplay. Uh, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed that Slenderman story. I know I did, and as always, this has been Guarded, signing out. Peace.